portion of Ahrimos Kedoshim has a verse. Sanctify yourselves and be holy, because I, the Lord your God, am holy. This verse requires clarification. Understood that the Almighty is holy. But it seems to say that because the Almighty is holy, therefore we should be holy. How is it possible to emulate the Almighty to being holy? So it's explained, explained at great length in Tanya and carried on by the successing Lubavitch Rebbe's. The expression is, he's Gadishta, when it says, sanctify yourself, bumutterlach, and those things which are permitted to you. It doesn't need to be said that those things which are forbidden, a person has to stay away from. That goes without saying. But those things which we are allowed to use, we have to use in order to serve Hashem. We've spoken about this before. The idea being is, is that we can somehow fit a mundane, mundane permitted item into our service of God, then we become co-creationists. The Almighty, it says, took spirituality and turned it into physical. Our job here in this world which is to make a dwelling place for the Almighty down in this world, which seems so void of God godliness, is to take the physical and to turn it into something spiritual. By doing that, by utilizing the world around us to serve God, we actually bring God down into this world, making not only the world holy, but making ourselves holy. It is a job that it's up to us. For the Uparsha, I'm Herschel Finman.